Hey, your brothers and mofos, that's going down. Stony back here on State of DK to where we are going to be talking about the new melee weapons here on the Independence Pack DLC. I don't know if you saw it, but I actually have this badass fully aluminum bat that's like American style. And it's even got a little cushy thing at the end for whatever the hell that's for. Uh, but anyway, dudes, let's see. We uh, Oh, firstly, if you don't know how to claim your DLC content, make sure to check out that video on my channel or I'll show you guys how to do that. Um, but anyway, basically you just pull up the radio, go to Independence Pack and blah, 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 whatever. And then you find the crate and yeah, get your good shit. So anyway, the three new melee weapons they added is one, the Freedom Ringer. It is a blunt melee weapon and you can see the stats here. It says this patriotic aluminum bat is reinforced with a weighted ring to really knock them out of the park. Okay, so that's a weight on the end. Holy hell, that's awesome. All right, the second one is the Grillmeister. We will equip that now. It's a big-ass spatula, basically, with a serrated edge. Uh, it's bladed, and you can see the stats here. Professional-grade stainless steel grilling tool with an aggressively serrated edge. Ready to handle meat both fresh and undead. Ooh, boy, that's awesome. Oh, we're going to be checking each of these out on zombies. So, And the last one is... Wait, where'd it go? What did I do? Oh, it's a new close combat weapon it's the barbecue fork and it replaces your good old knife the chef's knife wow that's badass all right so uh let's see the barbecue fork once used to grill up tasty meat for a meal is now used to puncture rancid meat before it can eat you ironic yet effective here we go that's badass how do i use that again oh yeah i think i have to get rid of i have to unequip this one there we go it's a barbecue fork boy Ooh, we got the moves. Look at that. All right, let's go check out this barbecue fork on some poor zombie. Uh, I don't even... Well, I guess since we're cooking up some meat, we might as well take the meat wagon. <laughs> yes. Yes, we're going to throw some zombies in the back. Cook them up. All right, let me exit the parking lot and see if there's any zombies nearby. Also, dudes, this DLC pack came with... Oh, there's some zombies. There's a lot of zombies. That's too many zombies. I just came up on a horde with a melee weapon. All right. Oh, oh. Can't touch me. Oh, shit. There's a feral. There's one whole feral. You dick. Go away. No. Why do they always have to ruin my life? Why? I wish I had an explosive right now. You dick. Get out of here. Ah! Can't get him. Almost. 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 Come on. Keep it up. Oh, my stamina's out. Oh, oh shit. Dude, I swear to God, these ferals, man, they're the worst. Get out of here and die! Waste all my ammo trying to kill this fucking thing. I'm legit getting mad at this thing right now, bro. Fuck you! These things are too fast. This is not fair. Fucker. Finally! Wow, he ran into the Zed Buster and died. What a freaking scrub! You freaking. Oh my god, you noob. Oh, I killed all the zombies. Whoops. Oh, there's. Okay, we checked out the chef's. Not... I mean, the. Uh, what is that called? The barbecue fork. Now, let's check out this freedom ringer bat there we go here we go look at the way he's holding it that's not how you hold a bat sir straight up rogue jedi stuff there we go damn son this bat is freaking bad ass dude let's check out this grill meister real quick and uh i figured i might as well mention as long as this duplication uh glitch that we found is working i will keep selling my inventory and now that the dlc pack is out i will uh sell a copy of my uh all of the dlc items but i'm gonna be selling i'm gonna be dropping you guys a whole lot i'm not just gonna drop what uh like just the bare minimum i'm gonna like duplicate the hell out of this on my own then come to you guys with a shit ton of dlc items so if you want a ton of new fireworks uh or a ton of the new melee weapons or ammo for the rocket launchers or even the rocket launchers themselves 
uh, feel free to message me and uh, I am taking $5 PayPal donations uh, for copies of all of that stuff. And I've also got a shit ton of Red Talon Scars, which I think they actually renamed in this patch to something else. But uh, for those of you who know what a Red Talon Scar is, I've got a lot of those with professional silencers and uh, they're scoped. So anyway, dudes, that is all about the new melee weapons that I can think to tell you guys. You could probably craft them in the facility. What's that one facility? Uh, I'm trying to think if I have it. I don't think I have it, but there's one where you can build melee weapons, and I can't think of what it is right now, but I'm assuming that you can probably craft these melee weapons in that thing. I think it's called, like, the armor or something. I can't remember, but anyway, dudes, hopefully you guys got something out of this video. Enjoy your Independence Pack DLC weapons and items, and keep an eye out on the channel for more how-to videos on State of Decay 2, and I will catch you guys on the flip-flop. Do 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 do